it's Lynn. It is finally summertime and it's getting a lot warmer now so I wanted to create a fresh natural smoky makeup look and that's what I'm wearing today. So if you'd like to find out exactly how I created this fresh natural smoky look then keep on watching. For my foundation, I'm blending Too Faced Born This Way foundation with the Pony Effect Strobing Luminizer to create a really glowy um, mixed foundation for the base of this look. Dot it evenly all over my face and then blend it all in with a beauty blender. This foundation is really going to catch um, the light and look really pretty without being too glittery and too over the top. And don't forget to take the foundation all the way to the neck. Next, I'm going to take this Maybelline Dream Lumi Concealer to highlight the dark circles and other dark spots on my face. And then I'm just going to blend it all in with the Beauty Blender. Once the concealer has been blended in pretty nicely, I'm going to take my loose translucent powder by Laura Mercier to bake my under eye area. So I'm just taking a bunch of the powder with a sponge and placing it right here. And while that all bakes up, I'm going to fill in my brows with the Revlon Brow Fantasy Pencil. And then I like to brush my brows out with a spoolie. Okay, now I'm gonna take a big fluffy brush and brush away that excess powder. And now our concealer is nice and set. Next, I'm gonna go into my contour and I'm gonna go pretty heavy on this. I'm taking my Benefit Hula Bronzer. I want this to be a really bronzy, smoky look. So don't be shy. So really taking this along my temple, right along my cheekbones and blending it out under my chin to really slim up that face. And then I'm going to contour my nose and my eye area with the same Hoola bronzer, I'm just taking a fluffy brush and I'm going to apply this pretty heavily um, above my natural crease. So really creating some more depth in this area and that's going to help to create this um, summery, smoky look. Oh no, I forgot eyeshadow primer! Next, I'm going to contour the nose. Just take this in a pretty straight line. Really makes my nose look a lot thinner. And if you feel like your nose contour is getting a little out of control, like mine did, you just pick up some more of that translucent loose powder with a brush and just brush along your contour and it just kind of softens everything out. Next I'm going to take this taupey brown shade called Easy Shadow from the Pony palette and I'm just going to use that as a transitional shade so I'm going to apply this all over my eyelids with a fluffy eyeshadow brush. Next I'm taking this darker brown color called Easy Brown from the same palette and I'm going to put that at the outer corners of my eyes. And then I'm going to take that same color and I'm going to apply it just right here in the inner corner of my eye. And that's going to help to create a more um, three-dimensional look to um, people who have flatter Asian eyes like I do. It'll just make the eye look a lot more um, 3D and rounded. You see the difference? This eye looks a little bit more rounded than this eye does. So I'm taking this um, dark brown shimmery shadow called Glam Coco from the same Pony palette. I'm going to apply this right at the outer corner of my eye. Right there. And now I'm taking the same color, whatever's left over on my brush, and taking it down to the lower third of my eye and I'm connecting that lower lash line with the upper lash line to really make my eyes look wider. I actually want to smoke out my lower eye a little bit more so I'm going to also take this really pretty coppery shade called Gold Shine from the same palette and I'm going to apply this all along the lower eye. 
isolated area. Next, I'm gonna do a little bit of highlighting with the Pony Effect Mirage Powder Highlighter. I'm gonna apply this right at the top of my cheekbones, right here above my eyebrow, along my nose, my cupid's bow, chin, and the center of my forehead. And then I'm also gonna take a little bit with my finger and apply it just on the inner corners of my eyes to highlight the eyes a little bit more. And then to add a little bit of color to my cheeks, I'm just going to apply a little bit of this Pony Effect blush in the shade Call You Mine. I just want it to be really subtle. I just don't want it to look like I'm super pale with a bunch of bronzer on. So just a little bit of color and then I'll dust the rest around the other parts of my face. There we go. For this look, I've decided that I am not really going to use eyeliner. I think I'm just going to go for the false lashes um, to keep the look nice and fresh. And never forget mascara. I'm using the Maybelline Falsies Volume Express. Black and waterproof. And I'm going to coat my upper lashes to blend them in with the falsies. And then I'm gonna apply this ColourPop Ultra Satin Lip Color in the shade Echo Park. And it's a really pretty neutral peach nude shade. I'm just gonna apply that all over my lip. And to add something a little fun and different, I'm gonna take that same gold eyeshadow that I applied on the center of my lids. And I'm just gonna put a little bit of this on the middle of my lips to create a little bit more of that bronzy shine and tie the look together. And that, you guys, concludes this natural, fresh, smoky, glowy makeup tutorial. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that little red button down below to subscribe to my channel for more. I hope you have a lovely, lovely week and I will see you guys in the next one.